Oh, good, good morning, everybody. It is Sunday morning. Uh, this is what I look like uh, fresh out of bed before I uh, get myself shaved and uh, ready for church. Um, but uh, I wanted to do a, I wanted to do a little something here to talk to the people out there a little more. A lot of the people who've been asking me the questions and whatnot about why don't I script what I do here on YouTube? It's not about that. A lot of these people here on YouTube, they expect to see something. And some of them are just haters looking for something negative to say. Well, I just want to let people know this. For those who don't know me already, I do a radio show, Wacko in the Morning. And, uh, and, you know, and people often ask me, script what I do. That's not what I'm about. That was, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not about scripting. And let me see if this will actually do a little better for me than uh, this this light here will. Yeah, this is actually much better. I don't script what I do with my shows. And I don't, I don't do it for a reason. Because my shows are supposed to be wacko, just like my YouTubes are supposed to be wacko. And that that's something that a lot of these people got to understand. Why script something when you, when you have a show that does 180s all the time as far as topics, as far as things go. I just want to bring that point out here. You know, that why am I going to do a script? Why am I going to do a script when, when things are supposed to be wacko? You know, a lot of people talk about what I did with, uh, with some of my topics, especially my three-part deal on, uh, on uh, who flipped the coin between uh, Richie, with Richie Valens between Tommy Alsup and Dion DiMucci. You know, and going through that whole spiel. A lot of people didn't understand. There were a lot of different places to go with on that one, too. And I was going with what I investigated, with what I found out. This is before YouTube, before they put the whole thing on YouTube to uh, put out the uh, little documentary they did on the day the music died, where you finally got to hear what Frankie Sardo had to say and what a lot of people had to say. And they're advertising that video big time. And I'm hoping to get that video once it does officially come out. But, uh... And, you know, there, there may be a final part to that. There are still some things that don't add up right, so i got to see the video because all they had was a preview there. But that notwithstanding, there you go. I went into another direction. I'm wacko. I'm wacko Bob. But these are the type of things that, that I do. These are the type of things that I do to get people to understand what I'm doing, what I'm talking about, what this is about. So people need to understand that end of it with me. So, so for people that want to know why I don't script, these are reasons why. And I'm not going to change that. I'm not going to change it because I know what directions to go into. I know where to take things. I know how to make the point. A lot more people get that than some of you, than some of you people that want to, want to sit there and find the negative. Now, I will admit there are some things where I just simply mailed it in and I was all over the place and they were bad. Bill Co the Bill Cosby uh, discussion is definitely one definite proof of example there. You know, I mean, I, I'm not infallible. I'm not infallible. Hell, for all I know, people are going to find mistakes here with this that I'm doing right now on YouTube. But I'm not going to script anything. That's not what I'm about. Key word, wacko. Key word. I was dealing with someone who was uh, wanting to go back and forth with me just yesterday alone, trying to get the person to understand that the guy was looking for anything to be in insulting, and when it came down to it, I called him out, and then gave him a concept to try talking about the topic for a change, like others were. So, I got this to say. I got this to say. For those of you that want to see me put more of a script together, get over it. That's not how I do it. I put it all together up here. And uh, and I know when I'm going to get out when I, when I'm going to get off topic or or go or uh, jump to the left or to the right. I know when I'm going to do that. So get used to it. Get used to it. You know, I do this for YouTube like anyone else does. If people stay on topic, that's great. I don't knock them. If they go off topic, that's great. I don't knock them. If they do something that is going to go 180 degrees the other way and they let it go on, they're probably letting it do that for a reason. Why should I knock them? I'm going to knock the people who do things that are just totally wrong, like what Don Marie did with Wrestler's Rescue, like what I see 
what I see Brother Ken, Christian Voice 08, do when he talks about music and talks about the typical Christian, which he knows nothing about, if he were if he were an actual Christian and not following some, some crazy doctrine, which he accuses me of doing. So, get over it. This is the way it's going to be with me. This is the way I'm going to do it. I do this with my YouTube. I do this on Facebook Live. I do this on my radio show. Wacko in the morning. Wacko Bob. Get the picture. Get the picture. And some people I talk to have, you know, have a description of what a wacko's format should be. Well, those people need to get over it. People like that are a dime a dozen. I'm a dime a dozen doing videos on YouTube like I do as well. I make no bones about it. So get over it. This is the way I do this is the way I do things. That's all I'm gonna say. Love me or love me or leave me. I'm not worried. Either way, I like your comments. I know you all are fans. Let's have a good time. That's because that's what this is about. This is about having a good time and having fun. And with that being said, I'll talk to everybody soon.